With self-driving cars becoming more and more popular, it's also increased conversations surrounding the pros and the cons of said self-driving cars. Yeah, while they've been touted for safety, a recent study from NC State shows there are some impacts on overall travel. CBS 17's Amalia Roy is digging deeper into the study after speaking with one of the authors. Self-driving cars can slow down traffic at intersections. The reason? Safety. We have programmed autonomous cars to be more cautious so that we can increase or maintain the same safety level. And as a result of that, what they do is that they maintain a longer distance between them and the car in front of them. Professor Ali Hajbabai, one of the main authors of the NC State study, says it comes down to communication. At any intersection, self-driving cars have to assess traffic lights, other vehicles, and pedestrians, and then choose the safest option. Which is why the study emphasizes the need for cars to be connected so they can communicate with each other and traffic systems. So when a car is connected, it can talk to the computer that controls the traffic light. And as a result of that, that car can have an understanding of when the traffic light is going to switch from red to green. Professor Haj Babai says the technology to do this exists, but requires changes in autonomous car design and traffic infrastructure to make it a reality. Luckily, we have time before these changes would need to be implemented. It's a long way to get to 30, 40 percent of autonomous vehicles, and by that time, hopefully, their logic is changed. In Raleigh, Amalia Roy, CBS 17 News.